Oh, my eyes. and burning as they went! It wasn't us! I built myself a home here. Ruid's clan attacked us as well. Oh! How nice to have a home to speak of, man! Please, all of you, be we Dana Saxon, we all want the same peace. With land to till and home till they break the peace with another bleeding raid. Nonsense. Their own... So what are these Danes attacking us, eh? What will you do about them? When I'm king... <laughs> <laughs> when I am your king, I'll set things right. You will be king when I am a flying troll. <clears throat> you handled that well. Disputes between Saxon and Dane don't always end so cleanly. That was a clean result. A dispute ending without bloodshed is as clean as they come. Quite a brutal outlook. I'm Eivor, of the Raven Clan. Are you Oswald? I am. You're not here to kill me, are you? I'm not in the habit of killing kings. But I do like meeting them. I am Oswald, yes. For as long as I can hold out. So, what happened here, Oswald? A clan, led by a Dane called Ruid, attacked this morning. They've been sacking farms and hamlets across East Anglia for some time now, growing more brazen by the day. Do they know this is Hafton's land? They must. They just don't care. Their chaos has touched my home as well, and I'm here to see that it doesn't happen again. Lately, I've come to learn that you are the hook that all hopes hang upon. As king, you could unite all the Saxons and friendly Danes. A minor weight to bear, isn't it? Who else, if not a king, should bear it? Travel with me, Eivor. We can discuss my tenuous future on the road home. What begs your attention in Elmenham? Wedding preparations. Elmam is on guard as we ready my marriage to the Dane woman Valdis. She's a cousin of Hafton's. Good. A well-matched marriage can forge a strong alliance. So what's the holdup? The holdup? I don't yet have permission to marry Valdis. Her brothers don't approve of me. Slow down. Something is not quite right here. Hold. There's smoke ahead. That's Beatley. It could be the same men who attacked at the walls of Norwich. Stay here. I'll have a look. Tremble as we thunder by.
multiverse. Ah, uh, their little worries, their little lives. They mean nothing to me. They're flies on shit. We have been learning Saxon words. Already they speak some Dunsk. Bring the coward down! <laughs> <laughs> Should be the last of these big faced cards. Oswald will be relieved to know of this. Druid's clan. They left none alive. God rest their souls. I'm needed at home to make yet another fruitless attempt to impress my betrothed family. Show more grit than you're showing me now, and they may start to like you. Yes, so if you joined us at... I'd be happy to join you. Wonderful. It's worse here than I feared.
I must be careful now.
Hey, what? Won't take long. Fight smart. Use your glimmer.
Strike with me! Watch for my lead! Try to trip the fool. Huh. 
Remember Bracky's double thrust?
for now. Follow my lead. Well said. 
You have stocks for a hundred moons. You will live a long and hearty life. But father, you are not too ill to stay. The air is filled with the smell of fish guts. Your catch appears generous. Your nets are... Good warrior, you carry yourself with the spirit of a Drenga. I am a Drenga too. In fishmonger slack. My life has had many chapters. Rag you rode with... I did. And it was here in ink I met a Saxon lady. But now I must show my son the way of the Drenga. How to die. I respect your desire. I want my son to watch. I accept your... F Do you hear this son? Any weapon? Now you see, son, we are Dranga. Its heat returns to me! Now you see, son, we are Dranga! Son, a true Dranger can win a battle with a twig or a stone! I have reached the glory gate. Think of me, my boy, my dear love. Now, you know. Father, I... I understand. I see the glory you spoke of. Go now to Valhalla, 
and join Ragnar in the War Eternal. Your father is a fine warrior. A Drenger to the end. One day, I will honor him and make of myself a Drenger. What do you see, Sunan? A healthy seeming town. This Oswald has done well for himself. Trust that. Shh, be kind, yeah? As Christ would command. Lords, ladies, this is a day of peace and fraternity. I asked you here to Elmenham to offer my thanks. And extend my generosity. Vinir, our steward, 
to our guests of honor, Broth here and Broder, and to my lovely bride to be, Valdis. You get to plow our sister because Halfdan commands it. But you won't drag us into bed with you, you hear? Uh, bro, dear, that The is... last Saxon king we backed wasn't half as mushy as you, and we lost 150 men protecting his maggoty ass. Bro, dear. If you're going to be rude, then I must ask you to leave. This is my home. I won't be insulted here. <laughs> is that why you've come? To back this thane who smells of goat shit and cheap pebbles? <laughs> I'm sorry, did you say something? Do I bore you, Wolfkist? I'm here to protect my clan. If that means helping your king secure his throne, well, so be it. <laughs> You'd be safer crowning the throne. It's made of less wood than, uh, this one. We'd all be safer if you had the stones to stand up to Ruid's clan. Between the pair of you, I can't see a single nugget. You watch your tongue, Wolfkist, or you'll find it freed of your face! So... Easily wounded by words. Imagine the ruin my axe would inflict on your flaccid ego. My flaccid what? Please stop this. You heard me. That's it. She called Ooh. us flaccid. Limp, weak, soft. Ridiculous! Oh. Absurd! <laughs> So full of vigor again. This is not how we settle disputes in East Anglia. That's enough fun for tonight. If that's all you've got, it's little wonder East Anglia is in the state it is. <sighs> you are weak, sheep herder. Well, that's me, Don. I think I prefer dream nonsense to these alehouse brawls. What a waste of time and good mead. These brothers will never back- This dance is just beginning, Oswald. Get some rest. You'll need your energy. And uh, will I see you in the morning? We have much to discuss, I think. I will find a place to lay my head. And, Eivor, if you can help me right this situation, you'll have a strong alliance with East Anglia. That much, I promise. Oswald has set out for the day. 
I should have a word with him. Ship bishops were he will. Ah, good morning. Up bright and early. You can labor like a thrall, but you're no good with feasts. Not a good start for a king. No, indeed. I find a solitary comfort in my menial labors. Not something a king should admit to, I suppose. The brothers shamed you at dinner. It's your duty to answer their insults. Don't let the matter lay unresolved. Oh, it was a petty row with henhouse wolves. I'd sooner answer the moo of a cow than worry about their insults. I have a wedding to plan and a kingdom to save. I haven't time to suffer fools. They betrayed your hospitality, Oswald. Where I'm from. That's a grave insult. Well, well. Here's the mud-soaked Saxon who's been taxing my patience. Ah, uh, steward Finnair. I know I failed to impress at dinner yesterday eve, but fear not. The Danes will come around in time. You stay claim to the throne, you dazed dog with no bone. If Lord Halfdown were here, he'd squeeze ale from a stone. Yelling? Pinner, my dranger! Stick this cur in the ground! All mewling and spitting, here's Finnir the Hound! He has bark, but no bite! Just a puppy I've found! <laughs> what just happened? That is flighting, Oswald. Using rhyme and rhythm to lay a man flat. Try it! Match his verse! There's no man you can lead! You dunce of the thirds. Um, a glutton you are. Just stop eating your words. Not bad. Not bad. Under all that tough posturing is a sniveling boy. So dig deep. When he brags, take a jab at his manhood. I've sailed squalls and north winds. You, not even a breeze. But the winds that you sail... Blow between both your knees. Blow between both your... Oh, you mean farting. <laughs> He's an ugly puss, so when he brags, hit him back with something about his looks. I hail from the north, where the winters are season. But you're foul. You're a blister. You're a... a... Plague-ridden lesion. <laughs> oh, yes, that's very good. Plague-ridden lesion. He's got the wit of a boar, so when he insults you, make him feel stupid. When I'm done with you, cur, you'll be raven flock food. But your brain's soaked in mead, and your... Head's made of wood. Wood! Head's made of wood! Oswald, my boy, you're useless without your raven. This one's wrong for the throne. He's too soft and too tame.
Go on, give some back about his height this time. You claim you're a Dane, but your bloodline is stained. A wee dwarf must have ravished your mum in the rain! <sighs> well spoken. Before sword clash and blood flow, we destroy our enemies with well tamped words. You have a talent for verse, I'll give you that. But how long will that silver tongue hold up against an iron axe? Let's find out, Finir. I challenge you to a home gang. You don't mean that, Oswald. That's a fight to settle disputes, no? A home gang. A fight to the death, yes. Let's talk it out, then. <laughs> it's too late. The challenge has been made. But a fight against Finnia wouldn't be anything to boast about. You'll fight me. Hold on. This is... That said, I shouldn't be seen killing a Saxon in the streets of Elmenham. There's a nice islet down river, near Seahenge. The water will wash the blood clean away. Prepare the square, and we'll meet you there. I hope you're ready. Oh, I have to be. Just give me a moment to mentally prepare. Do not make us wait long. It would not be kingly. Hey, Ethel Clark. I should be cautious around here. Made it. Now tussle with care. <gasps> Done. 
You've still got the touch for drawing a square. I've been in East Anglia many summers now, but I'll always be a Dane. Must we do this, Eivor? Strength and courage are always a boon, Oswald. You'll need both if you want the Danes to accept you as king. True strength comes from resolve, Eivor. It speaks to us, a stern voice from within. I've never heard of talking guts, but a swift axe would silence that inner voice in seconds. You must be prepared. Wait, you're unarmed? Just do your best, I'll be fine. We'll forge your king out of you yet. Don't hold back. You felt that one? I'm still here. You want me to fight? Hard to believe this one will marry Valdis, don't you think? I'll battle you! You expect the Danes to follow this pork belly? I'm... I'm still breathing, aren't I? Show me what you can do, Saxon! Come now! Inspire us! You'll never be king at this rate! Is this the best East Anglia has to offer? Yes, and I'll... I'll prove it! Come on, fight! Finish this, Eivor! It pains me to watch! I'll... Ah! Whoa, was that too hard? It was a good strike. Keep going. It's a fight you seek. I'll do what I need to do. Eivor is the victor. But you've shown us something, Oswald. Stay down, Oswald. That's enough. I will... I will not stay down! You fought bravely. Not with great skill, but with spirit and courage. Always push back with everything you have. Even if you have to get dirty. Even if you must break the rules. Because there are no rules. Not if you answer a challenge head on. That's where honor lies. Not winning the fight, but living through it. A seaside brawl won't change the brothers' minds. Oswald must show results. The raiders who attacked Beatley have a camp down the coast. That would go a long way to building you up. And if you brought gifts for the brothers, spoils from the raid, they'd be in your debt. Time to wet your blade, Oswald. Eivor, I expect your longship crew could help with this attack. No one has been willing to take a stand against Ruid's clan before. We're a kingdom of farmers and merchants. Even farmers and merchants can fight when led by the right person. 
I hope your faith in pig farmers is not misplaced, Abel. There is work to do, yes. But we will rise to meet Ruid's clan. God will make certain of it. See any, I'll let you know. Stragglers. Nicely. Find something? There's a crate of hack silver here. More than we'll take it to the ship. A hard one for the first of many, Oswald. This is my gift to the brothers. I have more than enough wealth in Elmham to widen their eyes, but this will be a symbol of my commitment to our fight. It's a good start. Take what riches you find to Norwich, then send for the brothers. I'll meet you there.
Silver, livestock, and a trophy from our slain enemy. No battle then to Dane would ever follow this lump of lord into battle. I don't care how many shields he brings me. You mean to say you refuse my gifts, Broder? I don't have time for this. It's a generous offering, brother. You'd be a fool to turn your back. Refuse this and your shame will stain the name of your sons and their sons beyond. Stay out of this, wolf kissed. Take the gift. We have bigger problems. One of Ruid's men. Aye. Sniffing around the outer walls, looking for an easy way to slip a few dozen men inside. If there's one scout, there will be more. Something you might have learned if you kept him alive. I was passing water when he surprised me. It was either him or my plow sword. Where did you find this one? Just outside the Northwich Walls, by the water's edge. They will be looking for points of entry to sneak a herd of raiders through. Jesus. Find another scout. We'll question him. I'll look around. The rest of you stay here and out of sight. If I find anyone suspicious, I'll bring him here. Ruid scouts. Ruid scouts would be camped near their boats outside the city walls. One of them will talk. like one of Bruid's men. Wait, wait! What are you doing? I'm just a pig farmer. You are awfully well armed for a pig farmer. Stay down, muckworm. I have some friends who'd like to speak with you. Put me down! I tell you, I'm a cow farmer. Let me go, Dane. You said you were a pig farmer just moments ago. It, uh, it's not beyond reason. I tend to many livestock. You are as Dane as I am. Save your breath, liar. Did Ruid send you to? Speak now, and you may live to see tomorrow. Arger swine. That won't make you any friends here. A scolding like that is a mortal offense, boy. I killed the bastard. Don't give him time to act again. I'll ask once more. Why were you lurking around Norwich's walls? I came to pay my respects, Lord. To Oswald, the whimpering Saxon ergy of East Anglia. I could do that all day, you drooling bloodbladder. Only give me a reason. Lick my... Dunghole. Here's the tongue I use for licking. How does it feel against your ass? 
When the braziers lit at Dunwich, Ruit and his men will rally. They mean to attack Northwich by its weakest wall. <laughs> you English Danes are soft as butter now. Ruid sends his blessing, lady. He'll see you again very soon. That's enough to go on. Time to die. <laughs> That wasn't necessary. He insulted you before everyone gathered here. You should have struck him down yourself. I will not have blood spilt needlessly in my ca- Alive, this man was a risk. Valdis, this man spoke as if he knew you. Ruid was my husband. Your husband? You're married already. I was. We've been apart for five summers. I never... E East Anglia's prosperity depends on our safety and unity. With Ruid's clan stomping around, neither is possible. I must speak with him myself. Right. I'll start looking for a new king tomorrow. It was good to know you, Lord. Ruid will eat your lungs for supper, Oswald. Steer clear of him. If I'm to be a worthy king, I must meet the man who bedevils us. I'll light the brazier at Donich and face him when he comes. You sure you want to do this? Meeting Ruid in the open comes with many risks. It's the only way. Come, Oswald. We make for Donwich. And of course I will see the lot of you there as well. Else the songs of your cowardice will ring out over the generations. I'm sure you're heading to Dunwich any moment. We'll be there, Eivor. You don't speak for us, steward. Need I remind you, Wax, what Halfdan will do with us if East Anglia falls into Ruid's hands? Ruid 
its men tore through it. Abel, you made it. Dunwich. It is time to light the brazier. I'll light it. You do the talking. Ruther, Valdis, and I will scout the dock. Make sure there are no surprises. Oswald and I will hold here until the brazier is lit. The front gate is heavily guarded. You'll not be walking in. I'll find my own way. We'll be watching you back. Feel stronger already. Dunwich. Now to clear out Ruid's men and light that brazier. How long will the scouts return? I want to be out there, raiding and pillaging. Not here! Scratching my thighs. If I know Bjarngel, he'll be drunk and sober six times before he's back. He's a fox. Won't go for the goose while the hounds are out. The bandits are cold. I'd not be surprised if one of their leaders sees the power. Good. Won't go for the goose while the hounds are out. Bandits are bold. I'd not be surprised if one of their leaders seized power. Moving right along. Hang on! Throw the dog off strut! You're like for that!
Don't want you! That's the last of them. Once the brazier is lit, the rest of Reed's men should arrive. You have my thanks. Oh, then we swear that. We should be raised. We should not love. We should not love on you.
Odin gives me a bargain. A few dead men at my feet in exchange for a ripe East Anglia, and my wife returned. What a day! You. I don't know you. Any questions you have, you ask the king of East Anglia, and bend the knee while you do. <laughs> Who called for me? Was it you, Valdis, my love? Why would I call you now, after five happy years away from your stinking balls? I called you, Ruid. You, Oswald, the hopeful king of East Anglia, and Valdis's husband-to-be. Take your men and go. East Anglia is strong with Saxons and Danes united. It will not fall to raiders. <laughs> Must I set sail for Denmark with nothing to show for the journey, after coming all this way? You'll have my weight in silver. And an abundance of livestock and grain. I've taken ten times that already. What's the real prize? I'll make you an offer, Pigfoot. A home gang, just you and me, for the future of your kingdom. I accept. I accept. A fight to the death. East Anglia's the prize. Let it be heard. What? The hazel is laid. The square is made. When you see a chance, lead Valdis and the brothers to safety. They must not fight today. East Anglia needs them. Let me be your champion. No. He called on me. Whenever you're ready, king of sheep shit! I'm ready! They're breaking off. They've given up for now. That's put some distance between us. We can rest a moment. By Thor, he fought well. Raging like a bonfire. We should go back!
Oswald may have survived. Ruid as well. It's possible. Ruid's men will press their advantage. We must be ready when they attack. We'll go to Norwich. Meet me there when you can. He died a hero. There's no doubt. If his god won't take him, all the sword women will. Elmenham will not recover. None of us will. <laughs> 